Down is our first server over to Tyler Luke. There's all those options we talked about from TJ Young. Goes with the tweener on point one. <laughs> he was looking for that Ernie, confused himself. On a setup from Tyler Lou, the inside out roll. This is the quarterfinal match. Yeah, that's something to watch out for from both of these two, Tyler Lung and DJ Young. Both tall, athletic guys. Can Ernie from their respective sides. Again, emotionally, can Martinez, Vic, and Stone bounce back from such a big high beating the Johns brothers? Tyler Loom counters, then hammers it down the middle. Quick lead for the eight seed, Loom and Young. Fire fight, Wyatt Stone steps in. So tough to tell where DJ Young is going to go on these things from the middle. Disguises that forehand so well. There's the self proclaimed Ernie <laughs> King. DJ Young might have a better Ernie than Tyler Loon. Doing that little tomahawk grip. Four, two, one. Second serve. Four, two, two. Patient point, Jaume Martinez Vic hangs in. Yeah, that's where Loon can get a little bit too aggressive. Two leaves the court one. way too open, way too much open space for Young to cover. from DJ Young. Might have called that one out. Yeah. Gotten away with one there. Ah. 
little hesitation on that middle ball. I like that spot a lot. You have to attack Tyler Loom. Does not have great hands, good counters. Really is just so dangerous with that Ernie. But in terms of hand speed, that is his liability, as you can see right there. Very attackable. We'll see if Martinez Vic and Wyatt Stone pick that up and continue to go at Loon. And they will. Jaume Martinez Vic. I think they're listening. Goes straight ahead. Five more two. Oh, closer than they may have thought originally, and a bit of a run here, and a two-point lead for Martinez, Vic, and Stone. Yeah, Loon wants them to slow this down. No, 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 the right foot here when you land it. Right Don Stanley, you can hear him from a mile away on top of the line call on the footfall of DJ Young. Timeout. We have a challenge with referee's phone call. Referee's and I believe we'll have our Don Stanley will have the answer. After review, the referee's fault call stands. Challenge is lost and a timeout is lost. One timeout, two timeouts. We resume play at 7-4-2. Fault call stands. A couple boos from the crowd. I think <laughs> it was a good call, that back heel just touching the line. And if you're Martinez, Vic, and Stone continue to attack Tyler Lung with pace. Tyler Luke all over it. That lefty so lethal with the Ernie attack. Five, seven, one. Does it at the last second too. So impressive. It really is. Such a long reach. Well, doesn't look like it's quite attackable. Six, and seven, yet one. last second, like you said, all over it. Stone and Martinez Vic. Let's lengthen these points here. Find that rhythm again before going back. Speeding balls up. Finishing touch from DJ Young. Eight, he's on, he's on point. <laughs> Clanking paddles in the middle again. <laughs> for only, Young. only problem with that forehand in the middle, both players sometimes want to be the alpha. Good run, no less, for Lung and Young, recovering a one point lead. Tough to tell on TV, but so much action on that forehand roll. Tough to keep that paddle out in front, behind the kitchen. Cover there for Martinez Vic. Loom thought he had an alleyway for that first drive. Eight, seven, two. Six. Interesting dynamic in this match. Wyatt Stone, kind of like the younger brother to someone like DJ Young, who practice a lot together. Nine, seven, two. Still kind of in awe of DJ Young as opposed to maybe focusing on him as a direct competitor. 
What a play from Jaume Martinez Vic. Scrambled to get the drive on the left. Finds the angle on the counter. Seven nine one. Martinez Vic, by the way, got a silver medal in national championships back in Dallas last weekend. Men's singles. Ooh. Ambitious Ernie attempt. Yeah, really good Tyler. drop from Whitestone, dropping so quickly into the kitchen. So much topspin. To attack that ball. Second serve. I like that play, though. Hacking Lou with pace. Wyatt's Joan. <laughs> I'm not the little brother now, he said. Yeah, who's little brother? Game point now over to Martinez, Vic, and Stone. Some more tomahawk action. Allows you to reach a little bit further into the kitchen. Very Nine tough to one execute, one. but it does give you those few extra inches. Oh. Wyatt Stone Nine has inches. been clutch in the final stretch here. One more try to tie it. Oh, Vic goes inside out on Loong, almost got him. Can't believe he's there. Loong says, try it again. Tie game, 10 all. Game point now to Loong and Young. This has been back and forth between yeah. these two. Loong applying enough pressure with that Ernie, taking away enough space from the kitchen. DJ Young ends it. DJ Young just barely hanging on to take game one. Uh, fault called on DJ Young. And the Ernie attempts crossed the plane. White Stone, Martinez Vic, you could probably hit a lot of thirds. Third shot drives 70, 80% at Loom. Have a pretty Two, one, easy one. fifth shot. Martinez Vic buries it on Loom. Better there. I like that he's reaching in, forcing the issue against Loom. I think he's going to come up with good resets. Hey! 
DJ Young. I'm stoned there. I'm taking a few of those at loom. One, one, two. Not an ego match. Don't feel like you need to beat DJ Young down the line. the right attack, just the wrong target, if you ask me. One, one, one. Point. The athleticism of Loom, one of the under underrated aspects yeah, for him. Very good athlete. Two, one, one. Able to guard his body there on that attack from Martinez Vic. Second what do you think the most effective strategy is for Martinez Vic and Stone to capitalize on that one seed victory on these two? I think they need to attack a lot at Loom. A lot of third shot drives to him, then makes their fifth more manageable. Stone's getting a lot of good balls to attack. That would take them a little bit more yes, through sir. the middle, two, one, two. even cross court. Against someone with really good counters, I would say not to go attack cross. But against Loon, I think you're going to get a lot of points there. Point. Three, one, two. Showing a little bit of the inexperience this game. Four, one, two. Oh, oh, oh. Inside out on the Ernie touch. That is just way too good. Almost went from Bert to Ernie. <laughs> In the same sequence. Expected timeout fairly soon. If you're Martinez, Vic, and Stone. Six, one, we'll two. let this game get away from him too quickly. Too much pressure from Loon and Young. 7-1-2. 7 1 lead for them in game two. Yeah! Wow. DJ Young is unstoppable. Yeah, eight, taking one, up so much space through the middle. Great tactic from them. From Tie them in. in. Especially eight, one, with two. the loss of Ben and Colin. That is a fortuitous run for him. too much attacking straight ahead from Whitestone to DJ Young. I do like attack straight ahead, but not when DJ knows his game so well, has his number, so to speak. Not one, two. Sign out. So if you're Martinez, Vic, and Stone, what's the approach here on this serve and beyond to get back in? Just one point one at a time. Nine, They're down one nine here. Did switch up, having Stone now on the left. One, nine, no success, but I do like trying something new. Oh, DJ Young playing with his food there. Just a little <laughs> bit too <laughs> fancy. But up 9-1, all out. Oh, and this serve at a peculiar moment. Easier said than done. Not two, one. Point. Point set up by a fantastic drop. DJ Young able to do so much with that two-handed backhand. Ten, 
One more chance to close it out right here. 10 2 2. Point game, Lung and Young will take this.